After the backpack was found, Feliciano and five other volunteers decided to search the Culebra. And sadly, through these searches, it was confirmed that the girls were no longer alive. On June 19th, Chris's hip bone and Lizanne's shoe with her foot still inside it were found by these searchers. The remains had washed up under a tree on the banks of the Serpent River. The foot was in an advanced state of decay with skin still attached to it. Three fractures were found in the metatarsals, which are the bones that connect your ankle to your toes. And many reports state that Lizanne's foot was broken in 28 places, but it was really just the three fractures. Shortly after this, Chris's shorts were discovered by a group of searchers floating in the Serpent River more than five kilometers from Mirador and a half mile from where the backpack was found. One of Chris's hiking boots had been discovered by Feliciano and his team a few days before they found the shorts. Her foot was not inside the booth. Then on June 25th, it was confirmed that the pelvic bone discovered belonged to Chris. It had suffered a fracture that could have been caused by a fall, or it could have been caused by just the rough waters of the Serpent River. A few days later, three more bones were found. The bones were parts of Lizanne's left femur, tibia, and left foot. 